Greetings and welcome to not a 10 minute painting video, but rather a very exciting update video. One in which I've been wanting to make for quite some time. Now, as a lot of you know, about a year, year and a half ago, I released my first ebook, Acrylics for Beginners. In it, we talked about how to blend acrylic paint, when to grab water, what brushes to use. It covered all of the building blocks and all of the fundamental pieces of painting and the techniques used for them. And it went over great. However, over the last year, I've also been receiving messages asking, what do you do when you're not feeling creative, when you don't have the ideas, when you don't know what you want to paint? And it's something that I've been working on, trying to figure out how do we solve this issue. And a couple months ago, it came to me, I've been working tirelessly since it did, and I think that answer is a book of digital sketches, which I'm releasing today. Now, here I have 21 digital landscape sketches. They are in a PDF. You can make them smaller, you can make them larger, you can transfer them to canvas, you can sketch them. But if you have issues with sketches, don't you worry because they also come with 21 gridded versions of these as well to ensure that if you don't want to just trace it or if you don't want to just freehand it, you have something in between. That way, regardless of where you are on the drawing spectrum, whether you're a beginner or an advanced drawer, you can really jump into this and you can get it on the canvas so then you can start painting, you can add your own color palettes, and there you can really expand upon your own creativity. So you don't have to think about how to compositionally balance these landscapes, you don't have to think about the initial idea, but you still get to be really creative with it and create something that's unique and your own. So I thought this really was the answer. It's something where if you don't have an idea on a certain day, you can pull this out, you can pick one, and you can just sketch it out and then you can paint it. And you will have your very own piece of artwork. The color palette will probably be entirely different from everyone else's, and it'll be something that will help you get creative again, practice drawing, and ensure that you're just keeping up, getting better. So when you do have your own ideas, they'll be fantastic, you'll be well practiced. So with that being said, the book is out right now, it is available today. You can find it in the description box down below on Etsy where you'll find the original Acrylics for Beginners. It's a great book, I think you'll have a great time with it. It's also great for little paint parties, you get a lot of people together, everyone does it a little bit differently. It's a lot of fun. And if you finish these, send me pictures of them, I cannot wait to see and I'd love to share a couple of them over on the Facebook page. I'd also like to note a couple other little updates for the day. We are past 100,000 subscribers. Look at that! Which is massive. It is a big accomplishment, not just on me, but on you, the community. You share these videos, you talk about them, you do the paintings, and none of this would happen without you. I'm going to make a big video on 100,000 fairly soon. Get excited. But with that in mind, I'm looking to do a little bit more with the channel. I'm looking at maybe doing some oil painting videos, maybe doing some sketching videos. And because of that, I'm going to rebrand the channel from 10 minute paintings to stay creative painting. It's a phrase that we all know. It's a phrase that I think we all love. It's endearing at this point, And I think it'll sum up the channel really well. So look forward to that. A lot's happening. But again, big message for today, a lot of fun things coming in the future, but right now the book is out, it is available in the description. Go check it out, and um, I can't wait to see what you come up with.